Hi friends, this is Ramesh Pitla LLB. I am going to explain about uh, IPC session 304B Dowry Death. So, from ancient days onwards, it became like a culture that giving dowry to the family members. If there is no dowry, so many fathers are facing problem to make marriage happen in the family. So dowry became a tradition nowadays and few families are not ready for any marriage without taking any dowry. So what is dowry death? So within seven years of marriage life, if any woman dies because of physical hurt or if she is burnt because of any fire accident in the home, such kind of crimes are called dowry deaths by her husband or her in-laws or her family members, husband's family members. So if anyone commits for this dowry death, they will get the seven years of rigorous imprisonment plus fine. Sometimes even those people will get, I mean to say who committed this dowry death, these people will get lifetime imprisonment as well. So my dear friends, most of the people think that if they send their sister to or their daughter to another family, they think that they should treat their daughter or their sister like their own family member if they send to another family, another family. But when another family member, another family member's daughter or sister is coming to this person's family member, these guys are not able to give the same affection, same respect, how they used to give to that their family member. So my humble request is treat, respect, each and every woman with dignity. Of course, compared to the previous years, nowadays the dowry death uh, has been decreased, the rates are decreased. However, on the name of uh, eve teasing or assault on women modesty or rape cases, these cases are increased but compared to dowry deaths, the rates, the rate of the dowry death has been decreased. But however, if anyone commits for dowry death, rape or dowry death crime, they will get 7 years of imprisonment my dear friends. So please share this video to each and everyone and let us create awareness about women's safety. This is a time everyone has to stand and everyone has to support, everyone has to create an awareness. So please spread this, please share this video, please upload this video to your YouTube channels and create awareness about women's safety to each and everyone and let, have, let us have a safe country. Because where the women respect, where the women get the respect, there the God resides. That's what our elders, will, elders have been saying to that. But there is no respect, there is no safety for the women nowadays. And also I respect, I suggest women to call police if any assistance is required. First, try to call police in all emergency cases and try to get resolution for your cases. Thank you so much for watching this video and have a nice day.